played yeah, them we played there. them a couple weeks ago, and, and really, um, they put the ball in the air a lot, and they're really good there. And if we didn't challenge for everything, we were going to be in trouble. So uh, particularly her 21 up top is just, she's, she's a beast. She's hard to contain, really good in the air. So we had to make sure we had, uh, you know, her contested every time she touched the ball. I thought we did a really nice job of that. Maybe only one or two, you know, dangerous looks at all. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, we, we really limited their opportunities uh, inside the 18. Um, even on the corners, we did a nice job. And uh, my gosh, Jordan, Jordan came up big a couple times, uh, just getting to some balls in the air. So, um, you know, I, I, I think we learned what, what we had to do was to keep the ball, uh, keep it to our feet, keep it moving, and take away the ball in the air that they like to play. Right, how did you feel the defense did against Becca Wan, the 18 offense player of the year? Unbelievable. These guys uh, showed me some toughness tonight that I didn't even know they had, and, and I know a lot about them. And, uh, you know, I, I think we were probably coming up about mid uh, mid chest level <laughs> on some of them, and we battled inch uh, inch to inch, and and every every part of the air we battled for everything. Um, Kathleen showed why she's one of the best defenders in the country, right there. Miller and Kenyon were incredible. Uh, Mallon, uh, just 90 minutes from every one of them, and they were spectacular. So yeah, it doesn't get much better than that, really. That, that was that was incredible. Really. I mean, we had a lot of opportunities right from the beginning. It was actually funny that goal because before the game, Tucker's just like, hey, like, you're always taking the end line. How about you try cutting it sometimes and just take a shot? And I mean, the first time I did it, luckily, you know, luck went my way and it went in. So that was, that was really good. But before that, you know, Billy was getting shots off. Smeagol was getting shots off. So it was really nice to put one away. I mean, we knew Richmond's a good team. We knew they were going to come out strong. They were going to fight till the end. So we had a we had to match that intensity. And you know, Tucker got us pumped up. We came to play, and we I think we matched that intensity. I think we did a great job. You guys have UMass on Sunday. You didn't get a chance to play them. Is that no? It was a little bit kind of a surprise, I guess, to see them in the finals for one and for two. What did you see in their first semi? That well, I mean, they again, they just battle uh, and they take advantage of opportunities. So they're going to try to catch you in transition, and we have to do a really good job in the back of keeping our shape and not letting them get behind. Um, uh, again, I, I, I think that, you know, if we get enough healthy bodies and rested bodies here, we'll do a good job of keeping the ball and making them run around and, we can, you know, eventually I think wear them down, and that's our hope. Um, we're going to have to have some people that didn't play tonight jump in and, and play some roles for us on Sunday, though, because there's only, you know, so much the body can do three games in four days. And, and uh, but, you know, I mean, they're just a good, really sound team. They, they play well as a team. Uh, we're going to have to be on top of our game to, to get this championship, which we fully intend to do.